Hey everyone, welcome to Research Tech channel. Today we're gonna use this joystick module. It's like uh, it has uh, two potentiometers that we wire with our Arduino, and it gives us like an analog value to read it. We should read it from the Arduino, and then it's like uh, it has two axes, X and Y, and then we have this uh, button. We're gonna see how we're gonna use it and we're gonna divide like uh, this uh, little module into little codes code for button and uh, two codes for like the axis X and Y and we're gonna assemble them if we want so the wiring is very simple it's uh, written here we have like uh, ground and 5 volt then we have like uh, one pin for uh, X axis and one for Y axis then one for the button so first we're gonna wire the X axis and for this I'm gonna like have wire my 5 volt from the Arduino then from the ground and one from the the X axis I'm gonna work with the analog input zero so I'm gonna just upload a code it's a very simple code it's read the value from the from given here and it shows us on the serial monitor so here's my code it's like uh, very basic we just uh, declare like x-axis pin as a zero which is stand for the analog input zero and then we launch our, ser our serial and then we declare the pin mode and we show the the signal given from the axis so now i'm gonna upload it to oh sorry it's not wired yet i'm gonna insert my arduino upload code and we're gonna see the value i get on the serial monitor so here are the value i get so like uh, as uh, if you can see if uh, I use the potentiometer to control the DC motor speed I'm gonna leave the link for in uh, for it if you want so here we have like the value always range from the 0 to 1023 and for like for a potentiometer and here we are in the middle actually that's not quite accurate we should actually have like uh, 512 or 511 that's the middle of the 1023 but that's not a problem so here we have like the max value I'm just uh, point, uh, like uh, pushing the analog toward a direction that's the uh, resting position and that's zero so we have the zero and we have the 1023 which is okay but the problem stands here like uh, we are not fully in the middle. That's what you get actually when you buy uh, very cheap things from... Uh, Let's say China. 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 And here we have another code. is to read from the Y axis. It's wired on the one. It's same like uh, the previous one, but just we are here wired on the one. And everything is the same. Just I'm going to upload it. Like when I work when, with these modules which has like uh, several outputs or something, I like to divide it so you see how everything works and you can uh, uh, know how to use it easily. So here, here I have problem. Oh, sorry, I didn't wire the Y axis, that's why it's giving us this uh, chaotic numbers. I'm gonna wire the the pin for the Y with the one here we are okay as I said this is like the middle uh, number it's like uh, 514 which is like uh, near the 512 not like the X axis which was like uh, 493 it's like uh, a little bit far here we have our 0 and 1023 it's okay So this is like a uh, pretty simple to use. We just wired like X and Y, and you can like assemble the the project if you want.
uh, here I modified my code so to print like the y axis and the x axis is simple like I merged it to two code and I, I will upload it to my Arduino now I'm going to show on the serial monitor so those are like x axis and y axis at the same time I'm going to turn around my play with my joystick so this value you can read them from the uh, from the joystick and use them to control servo motor or simple motor or whatever you want this is why actually I use it now because I want to use it later in our projects and before I want to learn want you to learn how to use them uh, alone so back to our like uh, projects here and here this I divided my project into X axis Y axis now I should add the button I will show you why I let the button uh, uh, alone in last because it has a problem so I'm gonna wire it the button reads like from the uh, uh, wire to the digital output uh, input sorry this can uh, use two here it is now I'm gonna upload the code for the button alone now we can read like uh, values from the x axis and y axis from the joystick now I want to read the value of the button too so I wired it with my uh, uh, pin number two from the Arduino and just like the all uh, the previous reads only here we instead of analog read we use digital read from the button pin which is number two I'm gonna upload this code to my Arduino and use the serial monitor to watch like uh, to see the value given from the push button actually it should be even uh, either zero or one here's my serial port now we have a problem as you can see uh, zero one zero one zero one now I'm gonna press on the button now we have a CD0 zero. Zero, one, zero, one. that's a common problem of the push button uh, you only just add like a resistance to the ground but here when I tried it it didn't function so I used another uh, method I'm gonna show you here so this is it. my button wired with, with the pin number 2 so here what happens when I press 0 I get uh, sorry when I press the button I get zero when I lift it I get the zero one zero one zero one I don't know why and if you like have this uh, same problem all you have to do is add this uh, resistance I have here already in my breadboard and wire this with the resistance here and the same wire you should do it like with this pin number two this is what worked for me actually so here and but still we have like the same problem here it is, uh, it is a wire you wire it with this place of the pin sorry this this one second one I'm gonna leave a picture of this if you want sorry it's this it's actually this not this one this one so here like zero one zero zero I press zero and here when I press this I get a CD one and then I press I get a zero CD zero or CD one which actually could not uh, you may think is the inverse but you can adjust this in your codes so now it function I have no idea why because maybe I think I'm missing a resistance here or something you know like the Chinese module this is how they work sometimes you can uh, have some problem so this is it for the module for the joystick module you're gonna find in the link right below codes and wirings and also this uh, chaotic wiring I add here
the important is like the that functions so uh, i hope you liked it if you have a problem suggestion or something you can contact me or leave it in a comment and see you next time Thank you.